Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. Today, it's Christmas. No, I'm kidding, it's not. It's end of November, but for me, Christmas comes early. Today, I am vlogging. Again, I'm back to vlogging. I used to vlog a lot, not on this channel, on a different channel, but I decided I wanna get back into it because I really, really enjoyed it and I wanna share with you guys my experiences. Today, I am going for a personal training session. I am going to be going to the Tone Room here in London. As you may be new here, um, or I mean, I'm new here. This is a new channel so everyone's kind of new here you may know if you've seen my channel trailer that this channel is basically me attempting to show you guys how to maintain a fit figure a healthy lifestyle without really knowing what you're doing because like neither do I so yeah they were kind enough at the tone room to let me come in and have a free session and then just tell you guys just about how my experience was and it's gonna be completely honest review I'm gonna tell you guys if I liked the training if I liked the atmosphere the place excuse the greasy ass hair but who washes their hair before a workout because like not me so I told the personal trainer Sanjay is his name I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly I told him that I'm not interested really in cardio because I feel like a lot of times when I go to a personal training session or well, I mean I have a lot of times as if like girl you've been to a thousand like no but when I have been in the past for like the tryout ones they always focus so much on cardio and I'm just like I don't really need that. And I just told him like, I don't really wanna lose fat. Your girl's trying to keep her fat intact because we need to keep all the fat we can. It is winter, it is cold, and I don't wanna lose any weight. I told him that I don't wanna do cardio. I'm more interested in the other stuff, which I am not knowledgeable enough yet to let you guys know what that is, but we are going to find out. He said that he's going to work on my arms, booty, and I believe my legs today. So that's what we're gonna be focusing on. And I can't wait to see what's gonna happen. And I'm afraid because I am not so good at being told what to do. So, anyway, let's shut up and go and uh, let's see what we're gonna have to do today. I love how I'm saying we as if you guys are also gonna join me. Well, you kind of are, but you're not gonna be suffering through the exercises, are ya? I guess let me go and you guys join and watch. Let's go. Hi guys, it is the next morning. Oh boy, do I feel sore. Oh my god. I'm gonna be completely honest with you guys. I feel real rough. My ar <laughs> my arms right here. Oh, that's, a, that's, I feel that. Right here, my arms, right here, why am I so southern? Right here, my arms are killing me. My thighs are on fire. I feel a little rough. I, yeah. But I mean, I expected it, and I was told this was gonna happen, so I'm not completely shocked. It's a little like a kinder surprise. You wake up and you just don't know what you're gonna get, but something happens. Oh, my lower back as well is absolutely D-E-A-D, -E dead, and I still need to wash my hair. I didn't wash it, I know I'm the most disgusting human being ever. Today we're going to do stretching, we're gonna do a post-workout recovery day, and then we're gonna go to the sauna and have a sauna session, and then we're gonna take a hot shower going to a cold shower. So we're gonna take a real cold shower that's gonna rejuvenate us, and apparently, according to my boyfriend, make me feel newborn. So we'll see how we feel about that. And then I can finally wash my hair, so I'm so excited, and I'm gonna be washing my sheets as well. The best thing in the world, does anyone else have this? When you wash your hair, you also wanna wash your sheets that day so that when you like go to bed that night, everything is 
so clean. Comment down below if you do that because I do that. Anyway, I'm gonna make myself look a little more presentable and I will see you at the gym for some stretching. Okay, so I'm going to be stretching now. Like I said, I actually left it for the evening because I had a really busy day and I didn't have time, but I got my smoothie. And these are all the ingredients that are in the smoothie. I'm going to list them right here. Oats, mixed seeds, chia seeds, which I guess is kind of mixed seeds, frozen berries, banana, peanut butter, coconut shreds, Treads? Is that what it's called? Treads? You know what I mean? And maybe some other stuff, which I'll just pop right here for you guys to see. It is delicious. It is quite thick though, so... Oh, almond milk, obviously. Anyway, gonna drink this while I'm stretching, and uh, let's stretch. Also, apologies if my armpits are a little hairy, but it's, it's, it's been a while. No, I'm kidding. I have to do them like every morning. It's really rough. I'm a hairy woman. Let's go. after my swim and sauna. So important, sauna, so good for you. First, I'm gonna take my makeup off though because I cannot be in a sauna or anywhere with makeup on. This is the worst lighting ever. Also, I am washed. My hair is finally washed. It took about 84 years. I feel so clean. I feel so fresh. My face is not doing too well at the moment, but that's a whole other story. I also washed my sheets, so everything is just so clean and just fresh, and I feel so much better after the stretching. Like, you have no idea. Definitely stretch after a long, long session. Obviously, not everyone can just go to a sauna. Luckily, I have a sauna where I live. It's convenient for me, but I understand like not everyone can just pop over. I get that. That's totally fine. Just have a warm bath. I think that's a similar thing you can do. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. I know it was kind of a random little vlog, but it was my first ever personal training session where I went so hard with weights. I just wanted to vlog that because it is definitely a step up from my normal workout routine and it is the first time I really used weights and boy do I feel it in my body. But this is just the beginning, guys. So the exercises that you saw are great to begin with. Like I said, don't necessarily add too much weight, but just start with weights. I have written the kilograms that I'm using in each exercise. You can just start with those if you're feeling confident or lower. Don't feel like you need to start really high. This personal trainer really wanted to go hard, but you know, you have to also understand your limits and know what's too much, what's too little, but also don't be afraid to step up and try something. I was terrified to try the hip thrusts with 20 kilograms or 10 on each side. I did not think I could do that. Sometimes it's good to push yourself a little and I pushed myself and I could do it. Do not be afraid to push yourself because otherwise you'll end up in a routine where you stay away from the weights forever 
and then you'll never ever get onto them. So try it. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it so I know that you like vlogs like this so I can make more. Subscribe if you haven't already because I would love for you to join this journey. We are all just starting here on this channel and I would love for you to also be a part of it. So subscribe down below now. Go hit that button because it's free and it makes me happy to have you here. You can also follow me on Instagram if you wish. I post more workout stuff on there and just in general about my life. So if you're interested in my life, then go ahead, check it out. It's also free. Amazing. And again, thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.